Welcome to the Ask the Hair Guy Minute brought to you in part by Marks at the Point Salon Boutique here at 46 Royal Palm Point in Vero Beach on the beautiful Royal Palm Point. And today, speaking of beautiful, we've got the beautiful Allison Boots from Page 2 Design, a, a, a place full of gals. I'm sure you got questions. What's your question today? Oh, Mark, we have plenty of questions, but um, nail chipping, that's the worst. Ah, uh, nail that is chipping. the worst. But, you know, we have a lot of people that think that gel polish is really bad for your nails, um, even though it is great for the line of work that we're in. Gotcha. Well, look, first of all, you know, Mark's the Point Salon and Boutique, we act as a unit. And uh, every product that we carry, we carry for a reason. Uh, we have tested and tried and trued. We believe that we pick the best product that's available on the market today or I don't allow it in my store. That said, our choice is C&D shellac. Now, after uh, some consultation with our nail gal, what we've come up with is simply this. Obviously, not all human beings are the same, just like skin. Not everybody has oily skin, not everybody has dry skin, you know. So nail beds are much the same, your hair is much the same. Um, you know, sometimes because of the preparation in order to put gel nails on, we do have to cleanse the surface and kind of make sure there's no additional oils on the, on, the, on the nails and make sure it sticks real well. Some people will say that it can cause a little bit of dryness, but that said, this is a relationship you build with your nail tech. Your nail tech should be informing you. The product that we choose uh, for you to take home and use in between visits is our C&D, and it's our Rescue RX. It has a wonderful jojoba oil and some keratin proteins. You actually use it on the cuticle, it absorbs through the cuticle into the bed of your nails, thus moisturizing and preserving the bed of your nails and not leaving you in that dry state. Allison, thank you for your question. I hope you find it helpful. You're listening to Ask the Hair Guy Minute. Log on to AskTheHairGuy.com.